The Live 2D 5.3 beta has been released, so let's go over some of the features. We're getting new blend modes that pretty much look exactly as intended compared to art softwares, and there are now multiple clipping and overlay types, so yes, we finally do have double clipping. And with off-screen drawing, opacity changes also no longer have that weird overlap issue. Denshi has said that VTube Studio won't be ready for these features quite yet, so unfortunately, you can't test them for export in VTube Studio. Glue is getting a new hardness feature for the brush, and we're also getting new brush shapes, including a square as well as a line shape. These work for the brush selection tool and deform brush. And we're also getting a new expand and contract brush as well, so you can deform your model to your heart's desire. Blend shapes can now be linked, and rotation deformers have the option to completely flip across the entire canvas rather than along their own axis. We can now export animations directly to WebM, and the symmetrical art mesh option will now allow you to grab and adjust vertices instead of becoming disconnected after placing. Unfortunately, the new alias feature will not be present in the alpha, but we can anticipate this returning at some point. It's sadly the one that I was most excited for next to double clipping, but if we've gotten through perpetual light mode and not having blend shapes at all, I think we can get through not having alias for a little bit longer. Now this isn't everything, there are tons of bug fixes and quality of life changes listed, so I will include the changelog in the description. Let me know in the comments which feature you are most excited for.